and welcome to the pilot episode of What Is This Nonsense? Where I get worked up about a subject and talk about it far longer and far more eloquently than the subject probably deserves. So today I went on a little Key of Awesome binge. Oh, I'm sorry. The Key of Awesome! The cool thing about the Key of Awesome is that they give you alternative lyrics to sing whenever the song comes on the radio or music or whatever, and you don't like the originals. I'm so tired of these games that we're playing, guess that's why they call them board games. When I hang around my house, I do it theatrically. Is somebody filming me? Father, son, and bearded nun. And sometimes they say what you know the artist really wanted to. Con, yay, why are you here? I don't like this version, you're not on the album. I'm peeing in your yard, I'm trying too hard. But I digress. Nope, I will do that often. So I've got my little Key of Awesome playlist, and I'm doing other stuff, so I've got it on, it's playing, and it's playing, and then it stops and I'm like, what? And this is on the screen. And I'm like, I, what, what, uh, really? This nonsense. What is this nonsense? This is the internet. The internet. Anybody who can get Wi Fi can watch anything at any time. That is the point of the internet. Show creators are so worried about censors that we get Disney Channel. We're so worried about censors on the radio that we get this. All over your face, you dirty, dirty. I want to. Oh, not. We're so worried about censors in movies that we get rom coms. The ones that give rom coms a really bad name, which is, I'm sorry to say, most of them. And now we're trying to censor the internet? Or rather, we're trying to cut out the boobs and the curse words and not things like, oh, I don't know, bigotry, wildly inaccurate, potentially harmful information. Boobs and curse words. Really? Really censor people? That's what you're worried about. I can hear the uber conservatives now. We have to protect family values. Again, Disney Channel. Those are sisters. If we don't have censors, what's the worst that could happen? Our children see a naked body? Our children learn about violence? That's called sociocultural history, also known as social studies. Our children hear a curse word? That's called going outside. They're gonna have to do it at some point in their lives. Now warnings are okay. On TV in Spain, they have a little 13 plus icon right around here, but they don't censor it. A five second pause at the beginning of a video. There will be boobs and curse words I can take. But cutting out stuff to make it more family friendly? Not letting movies be made because of too many boobs and curse words? No! Just... No! What is this nonsense? This is why I'm here, bad parents. Let me guide you through this. Get your kids away from the TV if you think they don't understand the concept of these people are gonna say bad words, you don't say them. Done. Sex scenes? We're never gonna see genitals. They're called bumping uglies for a reason. Your children are going to see boobs, hopefully a six pack, and then nothing else remotely new to them. Maybe a foot sticking out from under the covers. Come on. Drugs. Tell them, you know how when you eat candy you get hyper? They'll be like, yeah? This is something akin to that. I'll explain it to you in more detail later. Different drugs make people do different things. I think I described cocaine with the hyperactivity. Um, pot just makes people really lazy and sleepy. And happy, but primarily lazy and sleepy. So honest. Bad parents, show this video to your kids. MPAA and the FCC, you can kiss my angle side side. Wait, that's not the angle side side I meant, but that looks really cool. Like and favorite this if you agree with me. Leave a comment, I can't promise not to delete it. It depends on your grasp of sanity in English, or Spanish, or Italian as the case may be. 
subscribe if you like this and to stick around for more. I'm going to be doing political and religious issues as well. Next video is going to be about Gandhi, Buddha, Che Guevara, and Martin Luther King Jr. Um, there's a connection to them more than penis. So um, keep watching. I'm probably going to annotate it in once I've done it. It's also going to be down in the description. So thanks for watching. See you next time and bye!